Howdy, 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 my beautiful Aquarius. I hope you're doing well, darling. All right, my name is Simply Velka, and today I'm going to be getting into your weekly tarot reading, Aquarius, for March 2022, darling. All right, so if you enjoy this tarot reading today or you just enjoy my vibe, honey, all right, I would appreciate it if you were to give this video a like and subscribe, as well as let me know in the comments below how this tarot reading resonates with you this week. All right, let's just jump right into your reading here today, Aquarius. Let's see what's good, what's popping for you, honey all right oops all right we have the tower energy with the page of cups coming in here aquarius starting out strong honey starting out swinging darling okay as well as the nine of cups coming in and then we have the justice energy stepping forward scorpio energy as well as libra energy here i also hear the word aries um as well aries and leo that's just intuitive here um Aquarius, regardless of the situation here, um, dialing. <laughs> I like this a lot. Initially, when I just pulled that tower card, I was like, oop, but I like this a lot because it's like barriers are being broken. All right. You guys are so close, Aquarius, to unlocking the next phase in your life. Can I say that? All right. You guys are, I feel like some, most of you guys are breaking some type of cycle. If you haven't already, you're in the process of breaking this, some type of cycle in your life that you would always just like, you have like a love hate relationship with, and it was just, like every single time like you would try to get distance with the situation here and then you'd always find yourself like back into the situation like you would always find itself like you couldn't escape the situation even though that you you know that you deserved better or you knew that it's just like time to move on right and so for you guys here at tower energy this is actually really good in this dynamic because this is finally it's just like i mean honey there's no going back to this honey right once the tower moment happens i mean all you're going to be finding is ruins with this situation here so whatever it is that you guys have been just finding yourself yourself really hard to close out that cycle some of you guys it might be an, an obsession with like some type of addiction or just uh, you might be addicted to an energy you know it might be addicted to a person or food or, or whatever cigarettes again you know addictions honey right here um being closed off page of cups energy page of cups that represents new energy coming into your life here new people coming into your life set up nine of cups as well something that's a lot more fulfilling for you something that would be able to uh, further you down your path is what i hear further you down a lot more on your path than what this other situation was providing for you all right so let's expound on this a little bit here aquarius we have here the ten of cups interesting interesting Aquarius so it's like this is painting a scenario where it's like maybe in your old situation this person did not want kids this person did not want marriage or with this old job this situation they weren't wanting to give you a raise or what have you there was like a cap that you never could really quite overcome right with that situation it was just a really dense brick wall now with this new situation this new energy coming in here you have you get everything that you wanted um from that old energy this new energy provides it and then some for you all right you don't have to settle with this new uh this new energy whatsoever here but the importance of this energy only comes in after you have this tower moment some of you guys now darling all right just because i see this tower energy coming in here you could fight it you know you could this isn't promised here you have to really commit to this tower energy and allow this tower energy to really take hold um in whatever way that looks like right if you're trying to cut an addiction that tower moments could be coming in in a lot of ways sometimes it might be a little bit more inconvenient than what you were anticipating here but more cups energy darling all right ace of cups coming in here aquarius all right by y'all finally closing out and stop no longer clinging on to this other situation darling oh my gosh aquarius so much else opens up for you here it's like you finally stop clinging on to this thing that for some reason you were or you are so obsessed with just having it be part of your storyline for so long here that once you close that off and start this new life here you're just like oh my god why didn't i do this three years beforehand all right it's it's going to seem like such a simple change such a simple shift but it actually just changes everything in your life i feel like for this new for many of you uh, uh aquarius is if you're stepping out from an old relationship into an like i see you guys getting into a new one that just has everything that you wanted in terms of jobs and in that type of avenue here i feel like the best thing for you is if you recently lost a job or you're finding you're seeing so many signs with your current job that's like giving you a lot of reasons you're finding yourself having a lot of reasons aquarius of wanting to leave your current job here now i'm not telling you darling right use discretion i ain't telling you to quit this current job here but uh set you know set the appropriate measures for to have that tower moment with that old job here 
and once this new energy once you see sign of this page of cups energy uh, a peak of it right that's when you just let it all loose and just start going into this new thing because it just provides so much for you of course all right i have such a good feeling about this new energy here for you but you have to be um willing to let go of that binky right being willing to let go of that blankie that security blanket that you have that you've always known um that has always been your comfort uh knight of cups coming in here with the devil in the reverse as well as the four of cups coming in as well so for you guys here <laughs> that this is going to be your biggest problem honey all right like this new energy here i see a lot of you guys really fighting this really resisting it because y'all are just so insistent on managing with this other devil y'all some of you aquarius is i'm going to be honest here honey y'all are in some deep denial about this situation that you're currently in here and you're fighting that tower moment right you're fighting that tower moment or even maybe after the fact you have that tower moment any type of newness coming into your life any new energy any new people you're just like nope they're all devils you know can't trust all can't trust any man can't trust any woman whatever it is the situation uh, is for you like you can't block this off aquarius all right i can tell you what is being presented towards you but ultimately it's your choice to be deciding what you want to make of it all right you have the four cups energy here this is you um by paying attention to your current situation you're not being open to what spirits are trying to showcase to you right over here but because you're dealing with this unfulfilling situation like until you remove these cups honey you're not going to realize this other thing this this cup that has continuously followed you right you think about this one singular cup that's filled you think about the ace of cup that's also filled you think about the page of cup coming in that's you know there's this consistent message aquarius are you noticing it where it's just a singular cup always being offered trying to come in for you and i see some of you guys really trying to deny this or blocking this off initially because you're just like no 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 i want this other situation over here even though right now like it's not fruitful even though like the cups are just completely empty honey like you're still being you're clinging on to having your storyline play out in a specific way and if it doesn't play out in that specific way or the details don't look in the way that you're happy with you don't want to engage with it here but for many of you aquarius is you have to accept the fact that this is time for you to close out that painful cycle you guys still ultimately aquarius have to make that choice for yourself and be like all right like i need to close this phase out you can close out this period of struggle this isn't worth fighting for anymore right that's something that's a lot of you aquariuses need to hear that right now it's just like you need this isn't worth fighting for this underwhelming situation it's just like is the it's like this addiction that you have where it's just like you have like this period of just like a lot of stress a lot of anxiety with this situation the those small nuggets of just happiness of that what you would see as love or just what have you coming in it's almost addicting for you where it's just like oh well you have those really low lows and then when you get a breadcrumb it's just like the every like you get you feel as if you won the lottery because you dealt with such a um, low period with them here so it's like any sense of emotion or any acknowledgement on your end you're just like oh my god this is amazing right you deserve more than just like those short quick lived moments you deserve something like everything and then some aquarius all right but you have to be willing to make the choice and like disconnecting and trusting the process and being like by disconnecting from this you know <laughs> a lot of it you know what this reminds me of aquarius this reminds me of like stockholm syndrome heavy stockholm syndrome that's what this is a lot of you aquarius is you're dealing with some stockholm syndrome with this situation that you don't think it could, life could be any better than what it currently is here whether that's due to your own sense of self-worth or what have you but i digress aquarius let's continue on with your reading here let's see what else is uh in the works for you honey all right let's do one bridge shuffle here darling and let's get into this here <laughs> actually let's do two shuffles all right now let's get into this aquarius we have the hierophant energy stepping in for you as well as the judgment energy coming in here and then we have the ten of wands coming in Ooh, yeah this is what we were talking about this is what you were clinging on to right you know uh, aquarius if you don't jump ship before this um comes comes in contact with this iceberg honey you're going to be going down with the ship all right i'm going to be honest here judgment energy that's spirit making its own judgment call with the situation because they see this heaviness associated with this and so you got to make sure that you start putting yourself as the priority aquarius all right don't be afraid of jumping ships 
you need to jump ship, Sterling, because with this, your spiritual team, they're going to really make your life really uncomfortable with the situation. The more that you deal or like entertain this being part of your life, right? The more that you choose to invest your energy into this, right? So let's just say, for example, right, a toxic person, right? This toxic person is probably going to get progressively more and more toxic as time goes on and life events happening that just complicates things even more. Like, yeah, Nida Swords coming in here on that judgment. Like, that is, like what's going to be going down with this situation that you need to disconnect from is like the universe, your spiritual team is going to just start throwing all these things at you, Aquarius. They're going to be like, oh, here's this, 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 and this. It's going to be too much for you to eventually handle that you end up having to jump ships eventually anyways right but do you want to jump ships now before while it's still safe or do you want to jump ships after you got uh, several bruises and scratches honey right because this is going to be coming down whether you like it or not at this point it's going to be coming down whether you like it or not but you have to make the choice and like how much longer are you going to cling with this cling to that situation all right so let's see let's continue on with your reading here aquarius is there any other final thoughts in regards to this reading for you honey yeah, Aquarius, I just keep on hearing this message. Some of you guys have, like, you have convinced yourself about this situation that you're clinging on to, that this is meant to be part of your story, that this person is supposed to be like a soulmate or a twin flame, whatever you identify this energy with. You're putting on so much more spiritual weight or significance towards this situation than what it actually is. You think this this you're adding too much importance to this current situation that you convince yourself that anything coming forward would not be able to replace that three of wands five of cups energy continuously following you darling continuously following you here that with those cups those cups keep following you where you're paying attention to those cups that are empty that you're distracting yourself from those other cups two of wands here three of wands as well as the five of cups yeah i mean aquarius for you guys ultimately don't be crying over spilled milk if situation if you're noticing a lot of things coming being uprooted a lot of you know whatever it is that you have invested into maybe stocks or what have you honey right there's gonna be this like dip this dip has probably even started in some facet, whether this is financially, whether this is in a job, some relationship, the dip has started, right? And the sooner that you identify that dip, not only identify it, but realize that you need to, you know, pull out before it dips any further, like <laughs> pay attention to the signs, essentially is what I'm trying to say, Aquarius, pay attention to the signs. And the sooner that you um, escape yourself from that dip, then we can get into that beautiful energy that, that we were talking about beforehand with that page of cups, that ace of cups and all that goodness, Aquarius. All right. But, you know, pay attention to the signs that spirit has been leaving you because that dip has started. All right. And so that's really all I want to be stressing with you in this message. Ultimately, Aquarius is just pay attention to where that dip is because spirit spirit is going to it's going to like once you start noticing that dip, it's going to be going like it's going to be sinking, honey. All right. Because your spiritual team has had enough. They're ready for you to really start the next phase of your life, the next chapter in your life without this obsession, this obsessive thing that you have that Stockholm syndrome about that you have that addiction with. All right, Aquarius. So that's the reading that I have for you this week, darling. All right. I hope you found this reading helpful to you be sure to give this video a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this reading today i only do readings on my website um simplyvelka.com if you want a private reading as well as be sure to follow my social medias tiktok as well as instagram uh aquarius uh and it's all just simply valka but until next time darling i love you so much and i hope i can connect with you sometime in the near future bye aquarius